taking a nap here. Can't you see that? Sheesh. Oh, wait, what? You can't see this yet. You can't. Ah, perfect. Hello, everyone. I just woke up from my nap to welcome you back to my channel. I go by the name of RC Madwoman, but I will also answer to Heather. Today, my obsession with color changing dye continues. The last time we used this, I made a color changing rug. <laughs> color changing rug. And it was solar color changing. So I dyed my own yarn and I made a solar color changing rug. But this time, this time, we are gonna make a temperature changing pillow. It's gonna be amazing. We're gonna make a we're gonna make a pillow that changes color. And you know what? One of the best parts of this is that I am bringing Studio Ghibli, or Studio Ghibli, however you wanna say it, into Studio Artsy. Studio Ghibli makes some of my favorite comfort movies, some of my favorite movies in general. My personal favorite is probably Howl's Moving Castle slash probably Spirited Away. And I invite you to comment your favorite down in the comments. So Heather, what are you effing tufting? Shut up. What are you even tufting? You might ask. Well, my answer to you is we are going to be tufting a two-sided soot sprite pillow. Let me say that. I know. Let me say that again. <laughs> Calm yourselves. A two-sided Soot Sprite Pillow. Well, Heather, where is the color changing dye? Why are you blabbing about color changing dye again? The little Soot Sprite candies. The, the little Soot Sprite candies that they have. I'm gonna look up what they're called and I'm gonna put it right here. The little Soot Sprites are gonna have these adorable candies and they are going to change color. I know, I know. Hold your applause till the end because it does get spicy and dicey, okay? Did I? maybe do way too much why did i do this to myself <laughs> yes did i go absolutely overboard like i always do yes i did did i stain my bathtub maybe all will be answered throughout this video so let's get started <laughs> on dyeing our own yarn once again with temperature changing dye this time to the kitchen to boil some water. Are we gonna know how to get a cup and a half in each one? That's a good question. <laughs> Actually, don't they have measurements on them? That's a good point. <laughs> Now we stand here and watch it boil. Everyone's gonna be like, why does your water look nasty? It's bubbles. <laughs> it's bubbles. <laughs> I don't know, I just feel like a little bit of spit. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Hot water! Da -da 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 -da. I got them! The whole Roy G. Biv family, all in one place. Red, orange, green, blue, uh, pa purple, and pink. Okay. Just tell me when I'm there. Okay, good. Okay, good. <laughs> okay, good. That one is a lot quicker. By the way, these are the Solar Color Dust Hue Chromatic. Chromic. I always say chromatic. It's chromic. Hue. The Hue Chromic Color Changing Fabric Dye. See so yeah, how this one <laughs> is. <laughs> it changes <laughs> from purple to blue. <laughs> Pretty cool. <laughs> Oh my god, it changes like immediately. Amazing. <sighs> wow. Dude, I will never not be amazed by this stuff. This one is green to yellow. <gasps> oh my god. Yeah. Dude, what? We have red to orange. <gasps> well, good. Uh, I just love that they change immediately because, again, these ones are the temperature ones. And the last one is dark blue to pink. 
Oh my god, it's beautiful. Wow. That's so beautiful. Well, I hear something super fun and awesome. What? You can use code artsy with solar color dust to save money. Wah, 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 wah. Wah, wah, wah. Isn't that cool? Oh my god. I'm excited. Cotton. Ready? I think we're ready. Uh oh, problem. What? No, not problem. It's fine. I overreacted. All right, looks like it's all coated in there. Lay our babies right here. Swaddle them. <laughs> Mustard. It is very mustardy. Gonna squeeze it for all it's got. Center looks good. Oh my god, that looks so cool. Doesn't it? Is she gonna do this for every single one? Yes. What? I'm gonna dunk it. Yes. I'm gonna dunk it. Do it. <laughs> ah! Goodbye. That? Okay, I'm not usually an orange girl, but that? Right? Is a beautiful orange. Wait a second. What? What if? What if I took a skein of that and dunked it in all of these? Yeah. In I... different sections so that it didn't get muddy, but like different parts of the yarn would change to different colors. I'm gonna junk, junk it. I'm gonna, gonna junk it. I'm gonna junk it. Oh no. Remember we thought this was fine? It's not. Ah. Oh my god. What? That one over there, it's like wild berry. Oh, it is like wild berry. They're, they're very like yummy colors. Yeah. Alright, here we go. That's a great idea. Go. Whoa! Holy crap. I was so excited about that. <laughs> Soak that shit up, buddy. I don't know. This one? I don't know. Maybe this one. that one. That one. Ooh, wah. Uh, that's cool. It's a pretty cool skein of yarn. Shing. Shing. Shing, 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 shing. Hello, everybody. I am the Night Tufter. I tuft under the cover of darkness. No, um, I have my projector going. And I have drawn up a few different versions of Soot Sprite Cuties. I do have to position this, though, so I don't know why I started talking. All right, so here's the plan. I am going to make two pillows. My original plan was to make four pillows. I'm going to dial it down just a tiny bit, but I am going to make them double-sided. So really, it's still going to be like four different like Soot Sprite angles. So that means I'm going to have to draw this, go to the next one, move it over here, draw it over here. So we're going to do all of that. Right now. Zoobie 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 zoo. Cute. Okay. Sprite number one done. Pissing me off, buddy. Wah. Okay, oh, cutie number two, done. Uh, honestly, I think my own perfectionism is gonna be the end of me. I need to, I need to ditch that. Okay, cutie number three, done. Let's get the last one on there. All right. Okay, you guys. We have all four soot sprites drawn on the tufting fabric. They are adorable. So these two are slightly bigger than these two. So I'm planning to do one bigger pillow 
one smaller pillow. It's because I didn't plan things and I drew one too big. Well, who cares? It's fine. So next step is to begin tufting. We're going to start with the small details, which is like their little hairs, and work our way to the color changing yarn. Let us begin. Alright, for the sake of not being super repetitive, we're going to chuck yarn at them and it's going to magically fill it in. All their little soot sprite arms and their eyeballs have been tufted. I uh, did somehow manage to mess up the whole throwing the yarn at the tufting fabric thing, but I'm sure editing me made that cool. Right? I do have to get a different color for like the center of them because the center is kind of like a really dark brown. So anyway, we have to go to Joanne. I'm there every weekend. Come find me. All right, so this is the closest color I could find. It's still it's still not dark enough, I feel like, but we are at Michael's instead of Joanne's, which isn't my preference, but Joanne's is so far. Anyway, I did find this one, which is kind of a gray, but their bodies are so dark that I'm wondering if it won't even matter. I just want like a color that's a bit lighter than black so that there's a little bit of a difference between the black and like their bodies. All right, so yeah, I went with the like darker gray color just because I feel like it'll look better. So I'm just gonna roll them into little cakes with my yarn binder. All right, so the next thing that we're gonna do is we are going to re-roll our color changing yarn. Which, by the way, I did rinse this time in the tub, but they are a little bit wet still. So what I'm also gonna do is point my hair dryer at them while I'm rolling them. And hopefully that'll do the trick. And it'll warm up my hands. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna start with purple.
I have just eaten lunch and I am fueled by the power of chicken, rice, and strawberries. We are going to start tufting the stars, the color changing stars. <laughs> going to get the yarn, all right? That was a fabulous outline. All right, it's looking cute. It's looking real cute. I am going to bring you behind the tufting framing and I'm gonna leave you behind there all by yourself. I think you can do it. I think you'll be all right. I know it's gonna be, yeah, you know, it's gonna be a little spooky, um, you know, at first to be behind the tufting framing by yourself. But like I said, I really think that you can do it. You've got this, I believe in you. And I'm gonna be right on the other side. Just holler if you need anything. If you're getting too scared, let me know and I will come get you. I will come get you right away. But, but I should say, that's only if they decide that they think you're a good person. Otherwise, I don't know what will happen to you. So consider this like a little bit of a soot sprite vibe check. If you survive back here on your own, then you pass. And the soot sprites have accepted you and will protect you. All right? You're going to do great. How'd you guys do, huh? Oh my goodness. It looks like you passed. Good job. Was it spooky though? Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Oh my god. Wow. Look at him looking at it too. And since you've gained their trust, uh, you don't have to fear for your life back here anymore. Should, Should be good. good. I mean, unless of course some of you guys decide to be jerks and you don't like this video, but that that won't happen. I, I trust you guys. I, I That won't happen. I <laughs> I just don't even know what to say anymore. I feel like I don't need to say it, but this is going to be amazing. <laughs> All right, let's come back out here. All right, let's give this guy purple. Adorable. All right, so for this bigger star, instead of doing red, listen, I don't really like red. I don't, I don't really like red. But I am going to put red somewhere, just not here. I want to put this. This was one of our, like, combo colors. It's the purple and green. So the green changes yellow, and the purple changes to blue, I think. So I'm going to do this instead, because I love this. All right, purple and green. Let's do it. Pretty, pretty cool. All right, you guys, we're going to do a speed round. We're going to speed through the last of the tiny stars. Commence magical speed round. Here we go. Now for the last one. All right, so now that I have all the color changing stars on my cuties, I'm gonna go around and like measure, make sure like both sides of the pillow are gonna be the same size roughly. I'm just gonna draw a circle around each one. And I thought maybe you'd wanna watch me do that. No? Not interesting? Okay. Ta-da! Circles. Wow. <laughs> All right, let's tuft them. All right. <sighs> okay, let's do this. Wait, where are my scissors? Why 
All right, I found them. So, what the hell did you guys do? I was gone for like two seconds. Well, okay. Uh, I guess we're moving on. Let's try that again. All right, I will do this one, okay? Please don't. I do have to thread um, my tufting gun first. All right. Ugh, all threaded, so I think I'm... You guys are real funny. You guys did those two. I will do these two then, okay? And I'm gonna put you far back so that you can't possibly do it before me. All right? I'm doing this one. Got it? All right, I'm gonna put my hat on. And then we're gonna get started. <sighs> on this one. We're gonna get started on this one. You're gonna sit there and you're gonna watch and you're gonna enjoy these clips that I am about to film for you. Because if you don't, I am going to lose my mind and I will unleash these cuties on you. You don't wanna know what they can do when they don't like somebody. Kind of my job, you know, is a little rude that you're doing this. Well, whatever. Yogurt helps your digestion. Yogurt has no impact on your digestion. <laughs> Why did I do this to myself? Oh my god! What did I, what did I make for? <laughs> Why did I make their arms so long and skinny? Why can't I just make one of something? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Well, done tufting. <laughs> I can't believe it. Alright. I don't know if we've sat on the floor together before. Tufting's done. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna paint glue on these guys. I just figure, yeah, that's boring. So why don't you just look away? Just look away real quick, and when you look back, it, it'll, it'll, they'll have glue on them, okay? So just, you know, yeah, exactly. Yep, just look away, just real quick, okay? Perfect, perfect. See, now there's glue. You know, you just blink, and there it is. There it is. I also have the hiccups, so that's, that's what happened. Well, you know, you looked over there for two, two seconds. Glue, new hand, hiccups. Um, I... I'm gonna go upstairs and I will see you tomorrow. All right, so here's the deal. Uh, we're experiencing a snowstorm right now. We've lost power already. I'm afraid that we're gonna lose power during the finishing process of of all of this so i am going to fold down these edges without using hot glue and it sticks like really well like it's not gonna come up all right quick and easy baby i'm gonna do that for all four of our pieces what i'm gonna do now is i'm just gonna level everything out with my carpet carver and this like leveling guide
We're packing everything up because it's way too effing cold down here for me to do anything. Hi. So I made a few mistakes. Whoa, surprise. I made two of these. And this one is the smaller one. So I am hand stitching the edges together. So this is what it looks like. Many hours from now is gonna be the best part of this. It's gonna be stuffing this pillow and actually blah, turning it into a pillow. Okay, uh, some hours later, I have it mostly stitched. Obviously I have to leave a little bit of a hole to be able to turn it right side back out. Okay, yes. Yes. Look at this okay, pillow, we got guys. It, we got it, we got it. Hey, okay, let's stuff my cutie pillow. <laughs> All right, we're back down in my tundra room and I'm gonna start stuffing it with my scraps. Literally so full of scraps. Do you see this? Look at it. Here we go. Oh my gosh, I put, I put filled scraps in here. Apparently. You're not gonna feel it, you know? Yeah. Look at it, it's turning into a pillow, put. Oh my God. I bought like pillow filling just in case. And you know, Justin is here. <laughs> Let's finish this. I guess I'll just like stab through one first and then stab through the other. Hey, this is gonna work. Yeah, buddy. that looks good. Holy shit, man! This is the proper technique! <laughs> we made a pillow! We did. It's great. <laughs> <laughs> wow, this is comfy. Yeah? Yeah, because like I said, it like holds you up. It doesn't like sink in. I want it to change color. I wonder how long it'll take. See? Oh, yeah. Don't sniff it. No, I want pets. Hey, Neil, what do you think? This is another spooky pillow. Honestly. <laughs> so if I were like... <laughs> you know, then I think it would change. If I were a mouth breather like you. How to be rude on the internet. Step one. <laughs> Dude, I love this thing. You know, by just having my channel is a dream come true, but the things that I make in these videos is also making my dreams come true. A soot sprite color changing pillow is a dream <laughs> of mine that I made, I made come true. And it is so freaking cute and it's two sided. Both sides absolutely oh, adorable. So yeah, maybe, maybe I <laughs> overshot this and underestimated how much work just one of these would be. As for the other two, I've decided that I'm gonna do two rugs. Like I'm gonna turn them into two separate rugs and I think I'm gonna list them on my website. I will try to let you know uh, if and when that happens. Don't forget, you can use my code artsy on solar color dust, which is like the coolest thing ever. It will save you money and I also make a commission off of it, but it is the coolest thing. I adore solar color dust. And I genuinely think that you should dye your own yarn, whether you knit, crochet, whatever. I'm so proud of this. Like, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope that you enjoyed it. Make sure you give this video a like, subscribe to my channel and my vlog channel, which is not so artsy. You can follow me on Instagram, Pinterest, and TikTok. It is at Artsy Madwoman. We have merch. This is what some of it looks like. Haunted plant party. I love you to absolute death. 
And for everybody that gets something from my merch store, my fourth wall merch store, I send like a video thank you, which is the coolest thing. So I can thank you personally. The link for the merch is down in the description along with the link to becoming a member of my channel where I do bonus videos. I ask you guys what you wanna see and you get it. Bonus posts giving you like little sneak peeks of what I'm working on. There's emotes and badges. The link is down in the description. I love you guys to absolute death, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.